hello everyone uh, welcome back to my channel this is Raz so in this video I'm going to explain how to perform the multiple response analysis using SPSS so let me go to the steps directly okay so go to analyze okay go to analyze and then go to multiple response and click on define variable sets okay so on the bottom of that you can see frequencies and cross tabs but they are not highlighted yet cannot click on those because we have not yet defined the variable sets so click on that and here you can see variables in set okay so what it means is that you have to put all those variables which are a part of multiple response for example you want to know uh, what percentage of the people are using uh, which means of communication and there is a question in this data set on what is the means of communication uh, that you have at your household and then there are several uh, answers so uh, so for example the people might have wireless services they might have multiple lines voicemail paging services internet caller id call waiting television vcr studio for for example these are the different options okay and then you can see uh, variables are coded as categories and dichotomies okay so here they are coded as yes and no and then you have to be careful in um, identifying uh, which codes are used for yes and which codes are used for no so in this data set one means yes and no is represented by zero so here in counted value I put one okay so because one means yes in this data set and then I have to give the name and label so these all are the part of uh, the means of communication so I can give a variable name MAS means communication and in the label means of communication at household okay and click on add you can see that the multiple response set one set is created here so we can create many more sets depending on your questionnaire so in this questionnaire I just wanted to know um, the, the the analysis of uh, the means of communication in the household and then now I click on close okay I click on close and then again I go back to analyze and then go to multiple response now you can see that the frequency and cross tabs are highlighted because we already defined the variable sets now click on frequency here you can see the multiple response set means communication take it to the right okay and then click on ok so when you click on ok you can see um, the table which shows the different uh, means of communication with the numbers and with the percent and also the percent of cases so you can see two different percentages one is percent of response and another is percent of cases so percent of response is out of the total responses so the total responses is 36,412 okay and the percent of case is out of the total cases the the, the total case is uh, 6390 so 2547 have the wireless services so it's 39.9% uh, of the cases okay let me close this dialog box okay so in this way you can um, calculate the frequency of the multiple responses using SPSS okay um, so this is it if you like the video please uh, share it with your colleagues and if you have not yet subscribed to my channel please subscribe thank you bye bye and cheers